subscribe to this channel and turn on your notification bell icon. Thank you. Governor Baseke and his deputy Shuaibu receives PDP certificate of return. The National Chairman of the People's Democratic Party, Uche Secondus, on Saturday presented the party's certificate of return to the Edo State Governor Godwin Obaseke and his deputy. He said the party was delighted to have the governor, who he said has seen firsthand how the system and processes work within the PDP. Secondus also presented their inek nomination form to the governor. In response, Obaseke said, all that is left for one this afternoon is to tell you how I and my deputy are grateful to this great party. In our hours of tribulation, when we were pushed out of the raging storm, you gave us the umbrella. By the grace of God, victory is going to be ours at the end of the day. I want Mr. Chairman to thank my co-aspirants for being gracious enough to take the painful decision to step down after committing so much. Obaseke also announced that he, has, he was running with his deputy governor, Philip Schwaibel, saying, you don't change your winning team. Two of his co-aspirants who stepped down, Kenneth and Gidon, also attended the event. Following Obaseke's emergency as the gubernatorial candidate of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, in the general election slated for 2019. Governor Baseke and his running mate, Philip Schwaibu, has collected their certificate of return. Or Baseke will slug it out with Pastor Izzy Yambo of the All Progressive Congress, APC, and other 13 contestants in various parties come September 19, 2020. Then again, Obaseke made a, no, a statement earlier in the day. He said, I almost quitted from the race. Obaseke of Edo State on Friday said he almost quitted on his second term bid at the peak of his crisis with his predecessor. But for the encouragement he got from the fellow governors of the People's Democratic Party extraction, speaking at the Samuel Obey Media Stadium, where he was declared winner of the PDP governorship primary, having scored 1,952 votes out of the total 2,024 delegates that voted in the election. Obaseke also claimed that the three aspirants that stepped down for him did not ask for a dime. Shortly before the commencement of the voting, the true of Gideon, Honorable Emerigi, and Barista Kenneth all announced their stepping down for Governor Obaseke. Obaseke said, Today, history is being made in Nigeria because the victory we are celebrating today has been a long and strenuous one. Strenuous one to the political freedom which has culminated in my election as the flag bearer of our great party. And by the grace of God, I will be governor again for another four years. I wholeheartedly accept this responsibility, which has been entrusted on me by the representatives of our great party, and this responsibility will enable me to continue and consolidate on our achievements. It will help to give good governance in Edo State. It will also help to restore the pride of Edo people and make Edo State one of the best places to live and to do business in Nigeria. Today marks a defining moment in the political history of our state and indeed our country. Our story is one of courage in the midst of the contrived crisis and ultimate triumph over the progressive forces that were determined to hijack our state for their own selfish endeavors. With today's election, we have demonstrated that no mountain is too high to stop the aspiration of a people that has put their faith in God and are in one accord to make life better for the greater majority of their people. I must admit that there were moments during this recent struggle when, as a mere mortal, I almost tempted to quit, but I thank God for my family, friends, my colleague governors, my brother governors, 
Let me use this opportunity to thank the chairman of the PDP Governors Forum, Alaji Aminu Tambua, and our other colleagues, particularly Governor Nguike of River State, Governor Mahi of Eboin State, my brother, Governor Koa of Delta State, and many, many others. I want to thank our friends and our allies and you, our teaming supporters, who have provided the morale and safety for me to carry on to this day. He said, the desire to improve the lives of our Edo people have been my main driving force and our greatest incentive. Our team is concerned about this and our faith in our people and in our God remains unshaken. We have made remarkable progress, process in the areas of education, health, infrastructure, job, creation, security, among others, and we are determined to do more in the coming four years. I salute all Edo people at home and abroad, as well as our friends from the other states for standing on the belief that a better Edo state is possible. If we allow the people and not an overbearing godfather to lead, I implore you to keep faith and warn you that there is more hard work ahead. We are eternally grateful to the PDP governors, to the leaders of our great party, ably led by Senator Uche Sekondus, and all other members of the National Working Committee who have provided us the shelter under that large umbrella. We are grateful to those who emphatically told me, Governor Godwin Obaseke, anywhere you go, we will follow. You told me I was not alone in the struggle. As children of God, we will be magnanimous in victory, but we will win, not forgetting that our reigns were beating us. PDP provided us with umbrella. <laughs> those are the words of Governor Obaseke. <laughs> I must indeed say that Governor Baseke is a great man, a man that doesn't give up so easily, a man that is persistent, and I encourage all of us to emulate, from, emulate him because had it been he allowed his downfall to shake him, he won't be where he is today. So we all should try to be like him and better. You too can as well become part of this discussion by dropping your opinion and what you think concerning this at the comment section. But please and please do a subscribe to this channel and do not forget to turn on your notification bell icon to get notified whenever we make a new upload. See you in my next video. Thank you.